Cassie. I love you. And you are my best friend. And I've told you many times that I didn't think a woman like you was real. Someone that I could love so easily, but be everything else that I've ever wanted. You are my light on my darkest days. And you are the shield that protects my weak side. No matter what's going on in life, your smile and your touch brings joy. You've shown me what real love is again. Love that I didn't realize was still inside me. I see the pure joy and love you bring out Charlie and Chloe. And I can't tell you how much I appreciate that for me and them. You're a wonderful stepmother, and I know you'll be a wonderful mother to our new baby. You do all the little things, whether it's stay up late doing my laundry, making sure I have clean work clothes for work, or getting up at 4 a.m. to cook me breakfast, so I have breakfast to leave at 4.30, or taking small bites out of my food before I get home and telling me that it's a little mouse. <laughs> I notice all the little things that you don't notice you do. How you bite your nails and turn your feet in when you think. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> or how when you get really excited and you haven't seen me in a few days, and you do your happy dance where you run in place about 50 yards in <laughs> five seconds. I promise to love and protect you. I promise to encourage and inspire you to laugh with you and to comfort you in the hard times of struggle. I promise to cherish you and to always hold you in the highest regard. I promise to treat you with respect and always be honest and loyal to you. I give myself to you and these things I promise today and all of the days of our lives. I love you, Cassie. Trevor, I remember the way we met. Casey had told me about you a bit, and I, of course, thought you were super cute. I can't say I really had the highest expectations at the time, but when you walked through the door and I locked eyes with you the first time, it really felt like time stopped and all the butterflies and nervous energy kicked in. Through your calm demeanor and sweetness, you quickly made me feel comfortable and safe. The entire night we chatted, and when you left to go home, I was on pins and needles hoping I would hear from you again. I'm really thankful you messaged me like six minutes later, so I didn't have to sweat it out for too long. I just had so much fun with you and felt an immediate connection. All those feelings have continued to grow. You not only brought laughter back to my life, but the girls in you have given me a purpose. You three are my home now. I've learned through others and through my own experiences that love is a choice. We choose to love someone every day. Not just the easy days, but the challenging ones too. Those are the days that really count. Within the past year, we have had some extremely tough battles that we've faced. We have taken each challenging situation and navigated them hand in hand. Trevor, I want you to know your heart is safe with me. You're an easy man to love. I've never met someone with a more gentle and selfless heart. I see you for exactly who you are and love all of you. From parking lot adventures with you to mindlessly chatting with you in the kitchen until 2 a.m. on a work night, I always want to be near you. You're my best friend. Trevor, I vow to be in your corner, faithfully lean on you for shelter and protection. Let you be the little spoon as often as you want give you full honesty, even if the truth is hard. Support and defend you to help you through life, life struggles and celebrate your victories. And to be the best stepmom to Charlie and Chloe and mother to our new baby we are expecting soon. Trevor, I vow to choose to love you and our growing family every day with the support of God, family, and friends and choosing each other every day, we can get through anything and continue to grow this beautiful life together. My heart belongs to you. Mr. and Mrs. Trevor <laughs> He asked me if I had any hot single friends he could holler at, to which I immediately 
went straight to Facebook to show him the goddess. He had no idea he'd soon be calling his wife. <laughs> she agreed to go on one date with him, but obviously that's all it took. <laughs> the way they look at each other when they don't know anyone is watching is absolutely <laughs> breathtaking. I'm so happy that you both found exactly what you probably didn't even know you needed. Trevor, take care of this woman. She is truly one of a kind. Cassie, take care of this man because he is surely worth all the headaches. <laughs> May God bless you both with the strength to never give up and enough love to blanket each other for the rest of your days. I love you so much. I've seen Trevor at his best and I've also seen him at his worst, but ever since he's met Cassie, he's had a light in his eyes of true happiness. Cassie, I can't thank you enough for taking care of my nieces and my brother. I'm sorry it's this happening, but <laughs> one of us not the best but it's one of us <laughs> I wish y'all nothing but the best in your future together I love you guys I'd like I would like to make a toast now to the newlyweds before I go please raise your glasses and Trevor always remember happy wife happy life <laughs> Behind you, and now I'm 